Hello and welcome back guys, this is the Bank Coach here and today we are going to quickly do a demo on how to add your vCenter to your Active Directory domain. So we are going to log into the vCenter server. This is vCenter server 7. Once you're logged in, basically click on menu and then go to administration within administration you will see single sign on click on configuration and then you will see active directory domain So over here, you can click on So once you go to configuration and click identity providers, you'll find your vCenter there and then you can see join AD. Click on join AD and give your domain name. Organizational unit is optional. this username and password is for your ad So once you click on configuration, you need to go identity sources, you have active directory domain and then click on add, click on join domain, join ad which is right over here. Let's zoom in here. Going to give my domain name agileops.colotk and then this is optional but we need to give the administrator account and then we need to give the password bear in mind reboot the node to apply the changes so you will need to reboot the vCenter server click on join while we are joining this you can you can see now that you have active directory agile ops.colotk now adding active directory as a um, authentication source uh, gives you a lot of benefits especially if you are using other products or you are using in your organization then you can uh, customize the permissions add your ad groups directly rather than adding individual users so guys i have rebooted the vcenter server and it is successfully um, rebooted and then i'm going to log in for the first time go and verify in administrations 